my name is Seth Kweku Bani and today I'm going to show you how to design this. When I'm up through the night, I can't turn down the noise. Alright guys, so let's go to Photoshop and um, click Ctrl N to show you this. Now the client says he wants it a particular size, normally that's what you do and so he wants it, um, click here, he wants it 12 inches by 21 inches and so um, I just use inches for them as usual and then I use 100 resolution. You can use 300 resolution, it will still work. That will even give it more quality, but um, I want to use 100. And then you use CYMK if you want to print it. Okay, so you can click create. Um, let's name it wording invitation. Of course, wording invitation. All right, great. All right, so guys, please never forget this. Anytime you're about to start your design, Control R to bring your rulers, and then you'd use your rulers there. It's very important. It helps you align your documents very well. Now, if you design your document and it's not well aligned, it's, it's, it speaks volumes about you. So now that we have our rulers set and everything looks good like this, we want to start with the background. And with that, we want a solid color. And so we are going to use this particular color, 1-5. Okay, so this is the color we are going to use. Also, we want to bring in this flower. Hold out and then just, I think this size is quite good. Just drop it in there like that. Somewhere like that. Okay. Now Control J to duplicate it. Control T to transform it. Right click it and then click um or click flip to horizontal. Right click it again and then flip to vertical. Then you drag it to the side. So we want to put this in a folder and then we'll call it. Let's call it G. Let's pick this. Now guys, if you've been watching my videos, you realize that I always leave these resources in the description for you. Together with a complete uh, template of what I just designed. So you could also check the description. So I think this size is good. Let's see. Let's reduce it a little bit. So I think this is good. Let's zoom in. Let's make sure it's centered. Awesome. Pull your ruler here. Zoom in a little bit. Let's make sure it's, it is closer to it. Let's pull it here. It's closer to the circle. Then right click here. Choose ellipse tool. Then click on the, the corner here. Hold shift and just drag it. Just drag it. All right. Now this looks great. Make sure your stroke is off. Then let's set our fill to color white. nice drag the ellipse tool down here like this and then it should be fine click on your text tool and then type k also want to change the color to this if, if it's a different color just click here and then select the background color and then we want to move it up so that we can see it over here let's change the font to sitka sitka also make sure it's italic set the size to 73 and then make sure we select burner also let's make sure it is the tracking is zero and then let's drag it in here like this Control j pull it down double click it and then Let's put this bar to separate them. Control J again. Move it this way. Let's type M. And let's position it. So this what we have now. And then select this and this. And let's put it in a folder. And let's call it logo. Let's start with our text. Let's pick this, paste it there. Let's set the color to color white. The font is Sitka. And then um, 
make sure we change here to small also set the size of the font to 28 and then leading to auto and then let's change the color to color white like this make sure it is centered nicely i will have to zoom in for accuracy let's pull it up okay Control j to duplicate it and then you can drag it down okay. then we pick this one as well and then we just paste it in there you can use any detail that you love let's come and then group them as well let's call them top text now we can type the names of the couple skating now let's set the size to 77 also let's change the font to Madelican and then let's change the color to click OK let's center it Control J to duplicate it hold shift and let's drag it down all right let's click here let's type end <laughs> let's use sitka as usual let's change the font size to 28 then let's add a color to color white also make sure it is centered let's change this one to miranda santi paste it there nicely and then drag it up let's put all of them in the folder let's call it name let's type somewhere here and then let's pick invite this is where the name of the people you are going to invite will be and let's paste it there come here and then choose sitka let's set the size to 28 and then make sure it is centered nicely because we want to drag it up a little bit let's go back make sure here it's not italics great let's also make sure end here is not italics close it let's go to top text also want to make sure this is not italics and this is not italics all right duplicate the invite hold shift and drag it down then let's pick to celebrate the joy of your wording and let's paste it here we want this one to get closer to this let's duplicate it again and let's hold shift and drag it down a little bit then we are going to pick the venue C to copy it, Control V to paste it. Okay, let's drag this one down a little bit. We want to pick the numbers and use a different font for them. Let's use Arial this time for the font. Let's use Arial for the numbers, the font of the numbers. And we have 12 here, so let's use Arial okay also make sure the leading is set to auto the track is zero and the font color is white and then we can put them all in a folder and then let's name it venue gonna type here we want to let people know where we are going to have the after party the reception so very important uh, make sure they're centered Centered. We're going to use Alessandra demo for this, and we're going to set the font to 40 and then the tracking to zero. Make sure um, the color is also set to this particular color. Let's type here and let's put in this detail. So we're going to have the reception at every garden. Let's change the color to color white. Let's change the font to Sitka. Let's change the size to 28. And then let's make sure it's also centered 
as usual. And just so we don't get confused, we are not going to use this particular line anymore to pull it away. Okay. Next thing we are going to do is the RSVP. Paste it somewhere here. And then change the font to Baskerville BT. Let's set the size to 40. And then make sure the tracking is zero. Also make sure the color is... And then let's center it. Alright. Now let's bring our details. These are the people we need to call. We need any information. RSVP. Okay, paste it over here. Let's change it to Setka. Let's change the size to 28. Let's change the color to white as well. And then make sure it's no italics. Also make sure leading is set to zero. Perhaps we could change the banner to small. Um, and then let's bring it up a little bit. Let's see the whole thing and see how it looks like. Um, okay, so there's more room. Now this is where we need to arrange it. Let's put all this. Let's call it our SVP and reception. Nice, 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 nice. So let's put the RSVP and reception down a little bit. And then let's pull the venue down a little bit. Uh, let's also bring the names down a little bit. Let's see how it looks like. So ladies and gentlemen, this is how you create this kind of flyer. It's quite simple. I designed this for you. The templates will be in the description. All the resources I used will also be in the description as well for you. Please hit the bell icon and the subscribe button so that anytime I release new videos, you will be updated. I love you all, guys. I have some um, affiliate links down there for you to get your virtual visa card in case you want to purchase something online. You need a virtual visa card. Please um, follow the, the link. You'll get one for free. And if you're somebody who wants to start a YouTube account, they want to know how I manage my YouTube um, channel, please, there is also... A link down there as well to buddy follow the link and then you can use the free version or the paid version as well all depends on you i love you all guys see you next time peace out <laughs>